Welcome back, Dukes and Duke Gets. It's Eddie and TV. I'm back with another video, baby. Today I'm doing another reaction from, uh, Hey Steve! What? Why would I say it like that, bro? Doing another video from Hey Steve. <clears throat> uh, question segment on the show, uh, called Meeting the Man That Passed the Lie Detector. So, or the Lie Test. So let's see. Let's see what happens, man. Hey, if you haven't already subscribed, it's free. I promise you. You ain't gonna get a bill in the mail. I'm not gonna charge you, okay? Also, follow me on Instagram, Idiot TV. And yeah, um, let's get it rocking. Let's get it popping. Make sure you drop a challenge for me to do. Like, uh, if you guys wanna see me do a challenge video, drop down any challenge ideas you guys have in the description, uh, or not description, but the comments below. Without further ado, let's hop straight into the video. Idiot TV. Bow! Good for the guys who survived. Good for the guys who survived. Hello, she kind of fun. I'm a life coach, and I've been in LA almost two years. Nice to meet you. Okay. What's up? What's up, mate? Nah, nah. I'm a, nah. a singer-songwriter from Detroit, Michigan. Been in LA. Are you trying to go now? All right, all right. Let's see what you All right, now, Emily, uh, in the last segment, we asked uh, hey, Emily. a deal breaker questions. Now, we can ask mine. These are 14 questions that I've created for women to use on the first date. So these are my questions. You can ask them in any order you want to, to any gentleman you want. Yeah, she's yeah. smiling like extra like, I'll give you little cards. Oh, what? Pause. She over there grabbing the, the cute card with like a, you know what I mean? Um, okay, this also will be for both of you. We'll start with you, Lucas. What do you do in your spare time? I uh, nice do stand-up comedy, and I'm currently on my second book. Okay, very cool. I like it. And what about you? Music. I'm a singer, so that's what I do when I'm not at work. Even when you're not working, you're still working? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. What's the age range that you like to date? In mid-30s. Okay. Anything below has really not resulted into stability or... Okay, how old are you? 35. How old are you? 28. Ooh. We gotta... We gotta Mm-hmm. On either side there. But see, you got to hear Mm-hmm. See, that 28 a little bit different, though. It even sound different. <laughs> he said it with confidence. I mean, even in his answer over there, when he said, man, how you guys feel being the only one? Nah, I'll say it with confidence, too. I'm 28. Let's go. Let's go on this date. I'm 28. I'm 28. And I'm ready for this date. You heard me? I had to shoot. It didn't work. I had something in my eye. But snap. And shoot. If I if I was if if em, bro, em, I would say everything confidently in front of Emily. Come on now. I mean, uh, honest people. You know what he said? Well, well, at least my mother would be proud of. <laughs> you know. All right, one more. Okay, what is the one thing, this is for both of you, that you will not tolerate in a relationship? Mm -hmm. What is the, your deal breaker? Come on, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good question. I like this one. I like this. It's a really good, good question. One. Yeah. Okay, we'll start with you, Logan. Somebody who reacts angrily, uh, quickly, uh, and uh, kind of shoots down positive emotions, and somebody who's just not trying to get people on board with... Going after their dreams. Yeah, see, that, that, they, they. <laughs> Jarrell, what about you? Uh, I would have to say, left. Hey, you already know, <clears throat> before he even answers, right? I'm a, he gonna sound nice in class. He gonna sound nice and put together. He gonna sound strong and confident, baby. Yo, let's go. I have ambition. I have a plan. I know where I'm going, and I don't wanna have to drag anybody along with me. So. Short, short and sweet. Short and sweet. Good. Two good guys. That's all. This is what I'm gonna do, fellas. I'm gonna give you one closing argument. I'm gonna let you tell her why you would be the right person for her to go out with. Jarrell, I'm gonna start. With Nobody you. can do you like I do, uh, Mama. You see people before you hear them, so you're beautiful. Um, you seem like a smart lady. I would love to take some time to get to. Hold you. on, that was a bar. <laughs> I see people before I hear. I see people before I hear them. So I I thought that was see that's see that 
that was a nice way to tell that she was pretty in that and that he thought that she was fine because a lot of times when you tell ladies they find oh he just want me because I'm fine or, or or that's the only thing he look at. But the way he put it, he said I hear people or I see people before I hear people. So he saw before he heard and got to know. So hold up, we gotta hear that bar. That was a bar. That was a bar. I'm gonna let you tell her why you would be the right person for her to go out with. Jarrell, I'm gonna start with you. All right. Uh, you see people before you hear them, so you're beautiful. Uh, you seem like a smart lady. I would love to take some time to get to know you a little bit better, and we could definitely have a good time. Logan. I think it speaks volumes that you are on here trying to find a guy that is honest. Like, to me, that shows that you are actually pursuing something real as opposed to just swiping right. Yeah. <laughs> so to me, that means a lot. And also, you do seem like you have a good sense of humor and you're very beautiful. Thank you. So, so am I, who's it going to be? I'm going it's to gonna be me. not let age affect and any of those other things. I'm going to go with Jarrell. Wow. Z. The brothers won this time. <laughs> hey, but listen, man, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe down below. What the heck am I wearing underneath this beanie? It's a, it's a, it's a hair cap, man. I'm trying to moisturize my hair. I'm getting ready for, uh, for uh, braids. You know, I'm trying to protect the hair. So that's why I got the black thing underneath the hoodie. So, or not the hoodie, but the uh, beanie. So don't ask me no questions.